Hi, this is Gavin from calmahosting.com and in this video I'm just going to show you how to install MetaTrader onto your uh, VPS. So initially the thing you want to do is actually get a copy of MetaTrader. You'll generally be able to down these, download these from your broker and I've already downloaded one from FX Pro and just put it onto my local hard drive in an upload folder. So once you've done that, all you have to do is actually connect to your VPS and remote desktop connection. Uh, one thing to make sure is that under local resources in the more button you've got the C drive available so when you log into the VPS you'll be able to access the C drive on, on your local PC. So if we just OK that and click connect. And if I type in my passwords. Is connected. So now what you can see in my computer, if I go to C drive, uh, we've got the upload folder. So all I actually want to do to get up to my VPS is I can just drop and drag it onto the C drive of my VPS. And then you can see it's uploaded it. So now all we actually have to do is actually run FX Pro setup. FX Pro 4 setup. So if we double click that all the usual instructions. Uh, the installation folder is an important one to remember. Um, it will default to program files, usually x86, and then the name of your broker, then MetaTrader 4. So if you installed another version, another broker's MetaTrader, say Alpari, it would be Alpari-MetaTrader 4, but it will generally always go into the C program files folder. Um, it's always quite important just to remember where you installed it to, uh, especially because most uh, EAs or robots what want to know that. You don't have to install it to program files, but if you just stick it with default, it's a bit easier to remember. So if we hit next, and here it's actually selecting what the best base server for your copy of MetaTrader to connect to, and really that's it, it's finished. So if we hit finish, we'll just shut down this window, and it's just starting up for the first time. There we have a copy of MetaTrader. Actually, you need to get a login and password from your broker so you can log on with a demo or a link. Um, and that is really how you install MetaTrader onto your VPS. Uh, in the next couple of um, videos, I actually show how to optimize or speed up your MetaTrader on your VPS. So look out for them videos coming soon. Thanks for watching.